Thank you for choosing to watch this video. Alright, so in this video, I will be talking about 5 different tech gadgets for people who use Apple products. So if you own Apple products and you use them every day, be sure to watch the entire video as I will be talking about some important things that you might not have known before. Alright, let's get started with the video. The first one on the list is a wireless charger because I think everyone, everyone should have one. Even if your phone doesn't support wireless charging, get one because you can go to Amazon and buy a wireless charging pad that you stick onto the back of your phone. Most wireless chargers cost about $40 or some plastic ones, they cost around 20. But I recommend you get a glass one because they are usually thinner and they look better in my opinion. But if wireless charging isn't your style, then you can always pick up a fast charger. Of course, this is for iPhones, but there's also many fast chargers for Androids as well. In this case, the charging brick is 30 watts, and the cable is a USB-C to lightning cable that is 1 meter long. In total, this costs $80 in America, which obviously is below 100. This will allow you to charge your phone up to 50% in just 30 minutes. Next up, it's the Apple Pencil. I think everyone who has an iPad should get this. There's no reason not to. Of course, if you have the newest iPad Pro 3rd generation, then you would want the Apple Pencil 2, which costs $99. This one costs $70 in America. As you can see, I have a skin on it, so it doesn't get scratched. If you have this, I recommend you get a skin on it too. This is the microphone I use to make all of my videos. It comes with the stand and everything, the shock mount, the cables, and it only costs $50. It even comes with a windscreen and a pop filter. As you can see, it's the model NW800, which is higher than the NW700 that my friends use. Although, the newer NW800 can function without a phantom power box, it's still recommended to make the audio quality better. And the phantom power I'm using is the newer NW100 phantom power. And that only cost me $20. So this rounds up the entire video. Thank you for watching the entire thing. Please consider subscribing and liking this video. Also, don't forget to click on one of the things shown on screen right now. It really helps me so very, very much. Alright, thanks and goodbye.